Hello, this is Lillian, I'm a swimming coach. And during our last video, we discussed about entering to the pool and breathing. And today, we are going to discuss more about floating, and we have different types of float. So today, we focus most on the starfish float. And today, we are going to talk about back and the front float. Uh, when you are doing the front starfish float, your chin should be on your chest, facing down the, the floor, opening your arms, you go down slowly and you open your legs. Now I have here my students who are going to demonstrate to you. Okay, now you are going to show us a starfish float, okay? You put chin on your chest, facing the floor, and you open your arms. Okay, there we go. Go down, face down, head apart, relax, relax. That is the float. Go down to your relax. Most of the people find it hard to float on water. The reason behind is that when people are swimming, they tend to hold their breath. When you hold your breath, the lungs, the upper part of the body becomes lighter. Like the buoyancy increases. This causes the upper body to be up and the legs drop. So to correct this, uh, you have to exhale throughout when you are swimming or when you are floating. Now we are going to the back starfish float. When you drink the back starfish float, your head should come down and start from the wall. Open your legs, open your legs. I look up this guy, relax, mama, relax, Jasa. Well done, well done, Jasa. Good job! Yeah. Well done! Well done! You deserve a high five! Give me high five! Well done! 